Queensland's youth detention centres are so full, they're unsafe. That's the assessment from a Department of Justice draft report obtained by the ABC. It also contains the alarming statement that almost every girl in detention is suffering psychological damage from sexual assault. Matt Wordsworth has this exclusive story. Queensland has two youth detention centres, one in Brisbane and one in Townsville. This Justice Department draft consultation paper says safe capacity is 85%. Above that, and you risk escape and injury to staff and the detainees. But last year, safe levels were maintained for just 15 days. The centres were over 100% capacity for almost one third of the year. Concerning experts like Angie Dwyer. It's not appropriate in any way, shape or form. Of course, people are going to get more aggro. It's been fuelled by an explosion in detainee numbers, 36% in three years. The youngest, aged 11. The number of girls has tripled. It tells us that what's happening around the system and the diversion options that we have available, it's just not working. A new centre isn't slated until at least 2018, so interim ideas deemed suitable include throwing down a mattress to convert a single cell into a double, although it'd take up most of the floor. Using police watch houses such as Caloundra, where staff costs are $60,000 a week, and the mothballed children's court complex. Its five cells don't have toilets, 